Hi guys, my name is Narkusha Kwe and I'm one of the F3 Diva Fellows and today you'll be spending the day. So with I usually have um early start to my day on Diva days um, as I usually um, enjoy physical fellowship. So I try to travel to London when restrictions allow. Then we start off with the Diva catch up just before our um, teaching for the day and it's usually a, another chance just to um, update each other further on our how we're getting on and our current projects and a chance to be able to pray and encourage each other. Um, the last teaching session we had was on mental health which I think is a really important topic and it's very evident that um, in these times, um, especially in COVID, that uh, mental health is an issue that affects everyone. Um, and that it was just um, good to be reminded that there are so many examples in the Bible of um, people who have fa who've had mental health um, issues and um, that um, God cares both about our mental and physical health. And um, he is with us in um these difficult times um even though it might not feel like that sometimes um it's just also good to be reminded that as christians we should be very sensitive in how we um respond to and support people who are um facing um difficult times um especially with their mental health usually the day starts off with a prayer meeting um with all the CMF staff, um, volunteers, and also the DIPA fellows. And it's just a good time to be able to catch up with um, what everyone is up to and to be able to pray and encourage each other. Um, then we have lunch together. Um, and it's my favourite part because it's um, quite fun to decide with the others um, what cuisine we want to try for the day. The afternoon sessions on DIPA days are times where we get to um, catch up with our line managers and also work on our individual projects um, and I'm currently working on catching up with um, some of the previous Sydney delegates just to find out how Sydney is um, impacted on their lives and um, how they're using the um, sort of skills they gained um, currently. I have also been doing um, a Bible study with my line manager, um, looking at God's sovereignty. And it's just um, been a great encouragement to see God's faithfulness um, throughout the Bible. Um, and especially um, now with the uncertainty regarding COVID, that um, to be rest assured that God is still in control and has always been in control and even when we don't see or um feel it like he is still working so thank you guys for allowing me to share a bit of my deeper experience um be rest assured that god loves you and has um incredible plans for your lives um hope you have an incredible day ahead and definitely consider deeper if you haven't already it's an incredible experience not to be missed. Bye for now.